when we talk about energy, energy does have certain frequencies, and sometimes we don't understand that the highest frequency is the most simple. Mm -hmm. the, uh, I had an experience that I'd like to share. In fact, uh, earlier we were going to talk about my loss. I lost my only son to suicide, which was an intense experience 13 years ago. And on the day of his funeral, I practiced gratitude. And it was, you know, one of the most powerful things that I've ever had happen to me in my life. I was there with my granddaughter, my son's daughter, who was six months old. I had her in my arms. It was kind of a way for me to be distracted from what was going on. It wasn't really a, a, a very fun day. And I went outside, and I, was, I received the message that I needed to be grateful for every single thing I saw from that moment forward. So I was grateful for the sunshine. It was in July. I was grateful for my granddaughter's playfulness. She didn't understand what was happening, so she was just playing with the sunbeams. I was grateful for the people in the church that were crying, because that meant they loved my son. I was grateful for the beauty of the flowers. It was so many things that I was grateful for. And then somebody looked at me in my eyes and they said, you really are the person's mother who just died? And I said, yes. And she said, I can't believe it. You have so much joy in your eyes. How could that possibly be what's going on? that your son died and you're here at this funeral. And I said, well, I'm carrying the energy of being grateful that I'm still alive. And so that's what I'd like to share in terms of my own story. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, it's related to how we feel is related to our belief system, where if we believe in the continuity of life and we learn from our experiences and our biggest teachers are our biggest challenges. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So when we have challenges, either we do nothing, we stay the same, or become victims and deteriorate, or we learn from them and we evolve. And life is about evolution. Right. And even beyond that, it's about transformation. Because I think what happened, what you're talking about, Aaliyah, and what you're talking about, Melody, mm -hmm. is really transforming your energy on the spot through this practice of gratitude that this practice of gratitude is a frequency that was able to shift you yes. into another place entirely well Audrey what do you have to say I'd love to hear your, your, <laughs> your yeah. sense yeah. of gratitude what what is it that you have what I'm well I am just you know, it's, it's been very, a very interesting year for me because so many new things have come into my life, new understandings, and uh, one of the things that I've been practicing a lot is forgiveness. And I think, you know, that th all of these different frequencies are linked together, as you said, Tony. And I am really now grateful for the forgiveness opportunities that are presented to me because I realize that's me letting go of a part of my ego, perhaps, that's keeping me from having the fullest experience of life that I can have. So I, am, I have been, you know, in this forgiveness pro process, and every time, like, you know, my judging mind starts going, I just say, oh, another forgiveness opportunity. And, you know, so that's what I'm particularly grateful for at this moment. Thank you for asking, Lou. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, was, I was just uh, sad, and at the same time, uh, I feel like I'm standing on the shoulders of giants here. Mm -hmm. All of you have impressed me, only because I'm feeling your vibration. And uh, I thank you, Audrey, for, for having me, and I'm glad that I'm here. Mark, you're next. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm thankful that Lou's taken over hosting the show. <laughs> <laughs> so now I can close my... Um, this is a lot of fun for me. I'm grateful for the opportunity every Friday now to just put on a different hat and come here and have conversations with people that are worth having. Because I've had to slog through a lot of parties and get-togethers and that sort of thing. And what you want is that rare wine. You want that, that one-of-a-kind wine that you don't want to drink a second time. And you want to, you want to grow. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and it's, I always feel growth internally, but to have people around to help formalize it, to help manifest it, so to speak, to help strengthen it. I, you know, there, there's just a, a sense of it. Just, uh, you know, Lou is very responsible for 
the space opening up with Greg and the people at All Media for us and just how nicely that that's just how effortlessly that's all gracefully yes gracefully indeed full full of grace right mm -hmm. and 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 great full of greatness so mm -hmm. gratefulness is that full of greatness feeling and, and it's great uh, I'm also thankful for a vegetarian community, I just want to speak for the vegetarian community the day after Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. The people at Tofurkey have finally done it. It took them about 12 years to get, <laughs> to get a vegetarian turkey that you just didn't want to throw away immediately <laughs> or, or use to retread your tires, you know, and it was very good. So we had, we had a nice uh, get together. I'm grateful that my son's around and uh, he's been dealing with a, a health adjustment and that sort of thing. And I'm grateful to see all the environment of love that's come up on that as well. Thank you for asking. We have a caller. Ooh. We have a caller. Good. Go ahead, what? caller. Hello, Audrey. It's Dr. Jeff. Hi there, <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> How are you? Very good. Very good. Well, I just wanted to make a couple of comments. One is uh, I like Mark's hairstyle. <laughs> I'm grateful for that. <laughs> and I'm truly grateful for you guys talking about these things. I think it's very important to get this out so people can start thinking differently. And uh, having Tony there is terrific, too. Thank you. Yeah. So thanks for doing this, Audrey. It's great. You're very welcome. And Jeff, you are a regular guest on uh, Sweet Lou and Friends, are you not? Yeah, it's kind of interesting that Lou's not talking so much. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Jeff. It's good to hear your voice, man. <laughs> Thanks. 